Hey, hey, hey guys, this is Hawkeye, and I am back with another episode of Ice Lakes, and we are starting the competition or tournament once again. This is a four-part tournament, and we are only going after Pike. Now, in the last episode, we were at the West Coast map, and now we're going to one called North River. Now, to be perfectly honest, I have not fished this very much. I There's not a whole lot of missions that takes place here, so I'm going to have to be honest, this is going to be all new, so I don't have any good spots just yet, so I'm just going to try some things that I know, and hopefully everything will go just fine, but like I said, we're only going for pike, I'm going to go for the areas I know they're going to go for, I'm looking here at the species, the depth and all that just to make sure, yeah I have been here, but I'm like the biggest fish I ever caught there was 4.84, so not much not much going on there so anyway it's going to be in the evening in the winter and 30 minutes so that means during sunset so we should be able to go to rather shallow water and catch these guys hopefully and if that doesn't work we'll go into the deep water and see how it goes there all right let's go ahead and get this started this is only 30 minutes so it won't take that long one I mean, we really went above and beyond with the wind, so not as concerned at this point. Okay, we need to go this way. Yeah, I'm not as, like I said, I'm not as familiar with this lake. And I think what I'm going to do is I am going to get look at that and take a look and see what we've got here. We've got uh, some good spots actually right over here where this guy has already gone. If we go to the other side I think I think that might be good. Get a little thrown off by this map since it spins around. Yep, there he is. Actually, I might try right at the head of that channel because the bait fish come out the channel and the northern pike are waiting. At least that's what normally happens. the same lure. Hopefully it'll pay off this time. If not, we can change things around a little bit. Alright. Might need to get some more lure for this. We're getting a little low. Okay, there it is. We've got us a brown trout. So, does not count. Okay, that's okay. That's problematic. If we're getting brown trout, that's what we're going to be getting here, honestly. Well, let's go ahead and pull this. I'm going to go to a deeper place. I feel a little more confident in the deeper spots, anyway. Let's go right in the center of this guy. Jam, we don't have a lot of that left. Sharky. Night Sparkle, that's supposed to be actually pretty good. We got about 10 of those. Definitely need more. The grayscale was much better, but. Salmon. 
So this one's got me a little worried, though, because due to my unfamiliarity with the with the waterway. Okay, now we're in this. Now, he's not a monster, but we caught one, so that means we need to move on. Need to move down a little bit. So they are in the deep water. Now, why are these people always going to the shallow areas? That's what I don't understand. out and see if we can't get a bigger pike. This is the total weight, so as many of them as we can catch. I don't care if they're itty bitty, they'll add to the the total. another pike. They're not coming very big though. That's only two pounder. But again, we gotta move. Looks like they're kind of doing that too, so maybe they've adopted a similar technique. Okay, they've already fished that hole. So let me go past these knuckleheads and In. I'm not sure if this is the biggest part of this little lake or river or what you wa whatever you want to call it. I think it might be more like a reservoir. Okay, there's something. Still, we're not getting anything really monstrous here, guys. Okay, that is pretty nice brown trout. So we haven't caught our hike just yet. I just hope we're not going to get just brown trout, but we are in the middle of the main part of the river here, so the trout are going to be more common over here. It looks like they are going for that presentation, too. Yeah, we're getting brown trout. I only have to go back. Let me try it one more time. I think what I might do is bring this up just a little bit. So I bet this attract and also attracts them. I really didn't look. I think in the next tournament I'm going to see if I can get some more of that grayscale. Okay, that's, that's a good bite. That's a good bite right there. Ah, there we go. Three pounder. Yeah, they're not real, they're not real big. They're not, just not real big here. Okay, let's take a look at the map again. Get our bearings. Okay, so we're down here. The biggest part is over here, so we can turn around and go all the way down this way. I wish you could run a little faster. I already tried over here. We 
we might be able to try over here too. There's a it's far enough away from that hole, and I don't think we drilled that one, so. fast. Yeah, I'd like to get like a 15 pounder. That would give me a little more confidence in this competition. Yeah, we're getting a lot of brown trout. Can lift this off the bottom just a little. And the brown trout are definitely going to be on the bottom, so if we can avoid them. Yeah, I'm going to have to remember this for the next trout only competition. Are you kidding me? That is a baby. <laughs> He's little. He's a little fella. Holy crap. That, I mean, he counts. He adds to the pot, but... Lordy. That was a little, little bitty pike. Okay, let's see. Let's see if we can get in this deep area here. Let me make sure I'm over it. A little bit more. think they come that big here. This must be, you know, in some of these waterways, the fish have like a maximum set size. It might be they just don't exceed 10 pounds here or something. And that is highly possible. I mean, wow, they're just getting smaller. <laughs> That's crazy. Alright, we move on. Okay, doesn't look like anybody's drilled over here. Now, this isn't very deep, but I'm trying to cover some. can, and it is actually a little misleading. It is deeper than I, it appears. So, yeah, I don't know what's on the leaderboard for pike here, so. Brown trout. that off the bottom. Yeah, I'm just not seeing anything all that fantastic. Jeez! <laughs> He's a half a pound. Oh my goodness. Well, good lord. Well, let's go to the bigger part of the lake. There's too many guys over here, so... Looks like they've been drilling the dickens out of this part of the... Out of part of the lake, anyway. And yeah, nobody's really gone to the middle. I think it's worth a try. We can kind of go around this, too, in the time we have. Okay, let's try that before we put it down, see if that... 
again, I just lifted it off the bottom because, like I said, the trout seem to be really close to the bottom. Yep, they're still there. Move it up just a little more. Just not getting any monsters here. Okay, let's go over here just a little bit. We're going to try to stay close to this since we got less time. I'm going to stay on the bottom this time just to, just to see. Darn brown trout, then they're just okay. That wasn't too bad. Okay, now we're starting to move up a little bit. Okay, where else can we go here, guys? Actually, I might go over here. That actually looks kind of promising. Nobody, I don't think anybody else has. There's like a little deep hole over here in this little cove or whatever. Well, somebody's been here, but... I think I'm over it. It's hard to tell, honestly. be a monster hold up in here so there's the last of our attractant mm. we're running out of that fast I don't think okay that wasn't too bad well still about a pound and a half I have nothing over three pounds Nothing over three pounds, but that was not a waste of time, so that was good. Looks like somebody has tried this a few times, so... Like a lot of these guys are hovering around here. I'm just afraid I'm going to get a lot of this dang on brown trout out here, but we'll give it a try. attractant do we have we can use? Let's see, we got orange scales more than anything else, but that's for burbot. One gray scale left. Glitter. No. Only one of those left. And really, nothing is... Musky is about as close as we can get. Let's see what that does. They are in the same family, so... There we go. Okay, we got us a salmon. T. 
ten minutes to go. Yeah, this one, this one's got me a little concerned. Oh goodness, there's we got a school of salmon here or something. <laughs> salmon. Okay, hmm. Okay, let me lift that off the bottom a little bit. Well, we got us a little pike finally. Good God. The salmon are a lot bigger than he is. There's holes all over the place. <laughs> Alright, let's try over here. Looks like it's pretty pristine here. And here. To, no, right here. I think... think I might check my lures again here. See if there's anything that might work better. Right now I've got the tiger shark, which is supposed to be best for pike. There are others that are good for pike. Quite a few. I think the silver bite was one of them. Uh, maybe not. Which one was it? Green goblin is one. So I might try that one. Mix it up a little bit. Xander, huh? much better. Much better. Oh, I don't know if it might be a little too little too late though. Let's go back up. Man, well, that's a little... There's so many holes here. <laughs> Uncharted territory here. Let's go back in this area a little bit. Give this 
this place a good shot. Fight now for that. There's our pike. Well, we're getting them. We're definitely getting them. That's the good thing. Just not getting very big ones. <laughs> Yeah, I am curious to see what the leaderboard says about the sizes of them in this waterway, because they are just not very big. Has anybody been back here at all? Yep, there's been some people, but I can't tell if I'm over the deep area or not. I think I am. Try a little bit shallow. Maybe they're going to be hovering near the surface. I don't know. Wait, where the truck? There's something. White fish. Basically, prey. Looks like some bit. Yeah, we're almost out of time here, guys. Yeah, this could really be anybody else's game too. But I just don't think they come very big here. They're just little. Little bitty guys. Well, we need to start heading back this direction. Anyway, we'll dig one more, or drill one more hole. This is as good as any, because we don't have any time. get I think I missed him. One more try guys, we're not too far. Like I said nothing has been very big here, so it's not like it's gonna be hard to get out of the water. thing I want to do is get disqualified. <laughs> yeah, we got a bit of a walk. Should be able to just shimmy right up this hill. Now there's a fence. May have to go around it. Okay, those guys aren't even starting to come on, so seem all that concerned. Yeah, they make you kind of walk on this one. There we go. I'm definitely going to check that leaderboard. I am really curious. <coughs> I'm really curious to see how big they come here. I think it's everybody. Alright. Guess we'll see how we did. No idea. I 
I still came in first. I about almost double, almost double the next person. Next one down is 12.73, so they're just not coming very big here. Let's see, who caught the biggest fish? Well, that was a rainbow trout, so that didn't count anyway. Hmm, two of them got disqualified. So we're down to eight in this game. So, all right, that's good, honest. We're still in first place. Way ahead of the next person. Next competition is going to be another 45 minute one. That one's going to take place in Moose Lake. Now that lake I'm very familiar with, so that one should be a lot, lot easier to handle. But I am going to quickly check what that is on the leaderboard for that particular lake. Let's see here. We've got for Pike. doesn't tell you which... Yeah, it seems like the biggest of the pike have been caught in the Dragon Mountains. Let me check this real quick. I'll find it here in a second, guys. Alright, guys. I did check the leaderboard. The North River, the biggest pike, the largest pike ever caught, was 8.36 pounds. That's all. The biggest fish ever caught was, I believe, a salmon that was just around 12 and a half pounds. Let me go back up here. It's quite a ways, but yeah, it was... They definitely don't come very big in this particular lake. Yeah, 12.15 pounds. It was a salmon. There's a rainbow trout at 12.1. And that's, you know, ever. So, <laughs> yeah, they don't come very big there. So I don't feel so bad about that now. Alright guys, anyway, I hope you enjoyed that episode. Please be sure to share, comment, like, and subscribe. And I will be back with another episode of Ice Lakes. We'll be going on to the third leg at Moose Lake for the most pike. Anyway guys, as I always say, aim straight, cast far, and have fun, and I will see you later. Bye-bye.